So it's been a 26 year overnight success. <laughs> lots of hard work, um, lots of joy. Starting a business um, and raising children on your own, it's an enormous amount of work. But the thing I look back on it now, and I think one of the reasons my mom was successful is she didn't care about the money. She only cared about wellness. I am married, and I have four children, and I have help, and I know how much work that is. And my mother was divorced. She had two children, and she did not have help. My mother had another business. In 1971, she started a business exercise. Nobody exercised in 1971. Nobody. And she had two exercise studios, one in Buckhead and one at Peachtree Center. And my mother's always been incredibly um, generous to others, always before herself. And I think that that attributes to a lot of her success. If you ever met my mom, she was a dreamer. And she read about a juicer called a Norwalk. And she wanted it, but it was $1,500. She could not afford that, but she said someday. So she does the all-American thing. She gets out her credit card, and she buys the juicer. And that's how it began. No money, just my mom making juice and distributing it to her neighbors. Uh, we were very um, conservative in our growth. We uh, opened one store, then we got a plant to manufacture in, which was over at 14th and Howe Mill. Then we moved here to East Point in 2002. Over the years, we opened a few more stores. We now have 17. We'll be opening two more. And we opened a second plant in East Point on Sylvan in 2017. So we have a, a very strong footprint in East Point and South Fulton. <laughs> March 15th, which seems to stick out to me as the day when we shut down. Uh, we were hit pretty hard, I would say, the first month. But the thing that we saw is that people are advocating for their own health. And so our demand increased in the pandemic because people really know that if you put good things inside of your body, you're boosting your own immune system, and so you're fighting your own fight. And when we moved here in 2002, we honestly did not have any intention of opening a store here. And we didn't even have a sign on the front of the building, but we had our trucks out front. People would come up and just knock on the door, and we would buzz them in. And it was disrupting our day so much, we finally brought a cooler to the front. And then we got a cash register and we unlocked the front door. And that was all the community lifting us up. And the Tri-Cities embraced my mom as much as my mom embraced Tri-Cities. The Tri-Cities area is hungry for places to be healthy. And my mom just believed completely her mission in life was to help people be healthy. There's nothing else that mattered to her. Everything starts with nutrition. And she loved the Tri-Cities. She loved the people. She loved being on their level. My mother was a people person. And now her legacy continues in her absence. And I, I can't be more grateful that it's, it's here in East Point. <laughs>